Hey, I'm Simon Frost with Stanford Health News. Could you imagine working at the same place for 40 years? If the answer's no, how about uh, 57 years? That answer is still probably no. Well, what if I told you that at Stanford Health in Laverne, there are three employees who, if you add up all the years that they've worked at Stanford Health, it would be over 140. Let's head inside and meet them. How many years have you been here? 57 years. 57 years. Mm -hmm. If you live in Laverne, odds are you know Carol Weineke. I just can't even walk downtown without everybody knowing. <laughs> You're a celebrity. Uh, <laughs> and even if you don't live in Laverne, you might still know her. One of my daughters was probably a teenager, and I, we went up to the Mall of America, and she said, oh, right, nobody's going to know her there. Yep, there was somebody there. <laughs> she stayed at Sanford this long because it feels like home, and her coworkers Cheryl Grone and Vicki Nelson are a big reason why. We're always there for each other. Do you consider them friends? Yes. You bet. Close friends. <laughs> they know me better than some of my other friends. But he's not here. In September, Weineke's husband passed away. She needed Grown and Nelson more than ever. They were there. Yeah. But I hope he's got front row seat. He always knew, you know, I like my job. And I'm really glad I have my job now because. I need this, I needed this family for support. This week, Nelson is retiring from Sanford Laverne after 44 years. Are you gonna miss seeing her? I am, after 44 years, I am gonna miss her. I am happy for her because of why she's leaving, um, to enjoy her life with her family and those grandkids, they mean so much to her. It's simply in Nelson's nature to help those in need. I just love our patients. You know, we, I, I'm, we've got just sweet people in Laverne in the area. She's done it for 44 years at Sanford, and she'll be doing it in retirement. She's temporarily moving up to the Twin Cities because her grandkids both need a babysitter and said they just want to see their grandma. Yes, I just feel like uh, right now they need my help. So I'll go up there. And twist my arm to make me go to take care of grandkids. <laughs> Throughout the years, Weineke, Grown, and Nelson have learned to love each other. They all say that it hasn't been the easiest ride, but what binds them together is their love for patients and helping people. If you, you just dedicate yourself to it, and if you can make that, that you dedicate yourself to that, uh, you enjoy your job. In Laverne, Simon Floss, Sanford Health News.